Well, this is a new look ball club here in 1989-90 for the Los Angeles Lakers. One of the favorites among the players is seven-footer Vlade Divac. Tonight, we put the spotlight in the big man from Yugoslavia. When the captain, number 33, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, decided to retire last spring, the Lakers definitely had a big question mark to fill. But the smile on general manager Jerry West's face on draft day 1989 said it all. Because waiting there for the Lakers was a prototype NBA center. You know what I'm talking about. Seven foot one, big body, can shoot, rebound, run the floor. But the surprise was he wasn't coming from Georgetown, Syracuse, or UCLA. But would you believe Yugoslavia? The Los Angeles Lakers select Vladi Divac from Partizan Grel Belgrade, Yugoslavia. The name is Divac, and while he may be only 21 years old, he already has five years of professional hoops under his belt. He's played the last three seasons for the Yugoslavia national team, and this past summer, he led his country's Olympic club to a silver medal. Now he's traveled some 8,000 miles to Los Angeles, and becoming a Laker is a dream come true. He could not believe it. So the, the two biggest names in, uh, uh, from NBA in Yugoslavia are Lakers and Celtics. And uh, he just couldn't believe that he's going to be playing for one of them. He's going to be playing for Lakers. It was a big shot. Obviously, communicating is the hardest thing the 245-pounder has to overcome. And sometimes it can get a little embarrassing. KJ. Yeah, just say that. Okay. KJ. No, no. K-H. K-H. J. J. K-A-J. On the court, though, understanding his teammates and coaches is not much of a problem at all. It's universal. When you're out on the floor, I mean, players who play the game for a long time, the game speaks for itself. It really does. Partizan. Vlade not only understands, he has even turned the tables on his teammates and taught the coaches and players a few Yugoslavian words. One of them is called is, is, is terce, which means run harder, <laughs> and berzia, which is work, 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 work. Hersey Hawk. Out of the stolen by Divac. Dribble drive, right to the floor, lay it up and in. There's no doubt the fans have taken a liking to him, but no place is that more evident than in San Pedro. <laughs> San Pedro has the largest Yugoslavian community in the Southland, some 20,000 overall. Many of them work in the fishing industry. And now that a countryman is playing for the Lakers, basketball spirit is riding high. We're all excited, sure. We like to see, you know, one countryman play for Laker. With the people I talked, everybody is static. They just love it. Here in San Pedro, this is one of the most favorite hangout spots. It's called Ante's, and it's his restaurant. This is Anton. And... You know, we've been talking about Vlade Divac. Is the word going around right now about this new Laker? Are people talking about it in your yes, restaurant? Yes, they do. Yes, they do. And they're very happy that the kind of Lakers adapt somebody internationally in the team, which I think is a good for the country and good for the world. Good for the world and good for basketball. And those we talked to wanted to wish Divac good luck in a very special way. Dobro večer, Gume. Vlade Divac, dobrodošao u našu sredinu. Into the nose of Eddie Johnson, a good play by Cooper defensively. And off the nose of Eddie, it went out of bounds. Eddie Johnson loves to just catch it and shoot, and uh, Michael Cooper was all over him, made him try to put it on the floor. Against Dallas in the opening game of the year, eight rebounds and three block shots in just a few minutes of play for Vlade Divac. 36-26, Cooper with the ball has got... Worthy goes underneath for an alley-oop, nothing there. The ball to Vidac, down the middle, a hook shot of eight is good. Hook shot. Oh, he left Mark West out of the free throw line. Second year man. Double team by Chambers is worthy. He looks down the middle. Takes it underneath it. Divac to score. Oh, did they have a breakdown defensively? Eddie Johnson was supposed to be guarding him. That's right, and he lost him and worthy with the great vision. Four seats for Dallas, so get them at Ticketmaster or the four. The ball into Divac. Wants to turn underneath. He does and scores. Nice play. Well, he had that same kind of success against Armand Gilliam in the preseason. I don't think Armand knows how to defend Vlade. Well, Darlan, Ireland's only 6'9", too. Here's 22. 82-81 at the end of three on the Lakers basketball network. Comes around it, gets behind his pick, and didn't even look for the shot. You've got to take the shot when it's there. Divac down the middle. Hook on the way from Ken. No good, but he was fouled by Mark West, his fifth foul. If there's anybody that can afford to lose, it's Mark West. 
Exactly. He picks up his fifth. What does that do? That brings Tommy Chambers that's back right. into that's the, the ball game. That's the worst thing that happened to the Lakers. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Again, Mark West playing against a center that likes to put the ball on the floor, and he didn't move his feet enough, and he gets called for the blocking foul. Divac shooting his first free throw in the NBA. And if they're all like that, he'll be the best of ever lived. Chambers in, and Mark West goes out. Divac brings the Lakers to within two. Now to within one with a pair of free throws. Devon's in the ball game with a total of eight points. To the worthy and worthy to Devon. Now to Drew. Dribble drive. Underneath. Put it up. And missed the layup. Tipped by Devon. And tips it in. After it's kept alive by AC. Boy, Vladdy used his size very well that time. Good play. Nice, nice touch. To the seven on the clock. Worthy to five. He shoots the 20-footer. No good. The rebound up. Vladdy wants it. Saves it. Tight rope back by the seven-footer. 20-footer by Scott. Good. If you don't think Vlade made a guard play as a center, you're crazy. That is beautiful. That's nice agility for a seven-foot player. Here's a dribble drive. All right, they build it up to five again. But every time they build it up to five, those sons don't die. They just keep scratching back. So the Lakers are going to have to dig in and play some defense the last three minutes. The Lakers are going to take Vlade out of the lineup. Vlade Divac, who performed so well goes out and Michael Thompson comes in. Now, one of the reasons for that is that Phoenix is going with a small lineup. Thompson's got a lot more experience in the pressure cooker. Mark West is back in at center. He's got five fouls. The crowd is booing the substitution, taking D-Bots out. Now here's the ball to